Why, hey everybody out there in YouTube town, are you ready to get down? I know I am. This time with The Quiet Place Part 2, final trailer, with Emily Blunt and everybody else in it. She's the main lady, she and her family, the other ladies in it. Um, we liked it. I don't want to speak for you. you oh, I it. loved it. So, uh, what's in the description below? In the description below, we have some links for some fundraisers for the Black Lives Matter movement, as well as links to our Instagram, our Twitter, and our gaming channel. These are true statements. This is correct indeed. So, Quiet Place Part 2. Uh, we don't know anything about this. We saw a teaser a while ago, a first trailer, and it was really, really intense looking. It looked like they were raising stakes. It looked like there might be other characters involved. Mm -hmm. So, let's watch this one. Let's see where it goes. Yeah. And uh, we'll do a review afterwards and we'll speculate. Let's get to it. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. I'm excited. Play now in three, two, fun. Dude. I don't know why he came all the way up here. There's nothing left. There are people out there. People worth saving. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Those people had finally given hey. up hope. Is that John? <laughs> There's, okay, May 20th. Oh god. Hi, Max. That was a lot of intensity right there. Like, yeah. it's just a lot of intensity. Good, awesome intensity, but a lot of intensity right there. Um, okay, where to begin? Um, well, the first thing is we had more of, uh, of we had a quick recap. We showed like a little Krasinski at the at the tippy top there to sort of get a, like a little kind of a, a hint that he might be in here through flashbacks, which we assume would be the case. Uh, Chilean Murphy, Chilean Murphy? Chilean Murphy? Chilean Murphy uh, is in this. I, uh, the other actor is very familiar. I've seen him yeah. in other stuff before. I keep forgetting his name. I thought I said it properly. He has a hard to pronounce name for someone as dumb as me. So I just need to learn how to say his name better. But he's tremendous and I've seen him in other projects. Um, other than that, uh, where are we currently with this movie? How do you feel about the next progression in this story, the next chapter in A Quiet Place? I'm really curious. I want to know if we're going to learn more about the creatures, because that was really vague in the first one. No, I'm excited. They they have to add more people, because if they don't raise the stakes for the sequel, then it's it can kind of fall flat. That's a good point. So I'm yeah. excited that they're going after looking for survivors well it makes sense because like they can't just stay there forever they need help mm -hmm. they've already been there for so long and they've already lost like somebody someone they lost mm -hmm. the dad well, and, it's and like, the other kid and the other kid well before the dad died the other kid died but the whole point was that john krasinski's character dies mm -hmm. and they have a huge deficit from that loss mm -hmm. Yeah, the other kid died. Whatever. No, that's sad. I, don't get me wrong, it, but it, it influenced most of that movie. But the biggest takeaway from that first movie was that Krasinski's character died. And that that was a huge sudden loss. And we no one really expected it, really. We didn't want anyone to die, but, but his character did. We're like, damn, very impressive choice to make for the filmmakers. Because, you know, they, Krasinski's the director and star and the writer. He could have just kept going. He could have been like, you know what? And I live. <laughs> and I come back and I got a beard and a hook arm, right? And he's like Ash from Evil Dead. I would love that. 
Um, I don't know if they would ever do that, but I would love it if they tried. I just think that this is going to be a really cool idea to expand this this mm -hmm. universe and the lore of these creatures. Find out a little bit more, not too much. Find out what's going on. Are they terrestrial? Are they extraterrestrial? Like, what's their deal? Are they from another dimension? What the heck uh -huh. is going on? We don't actually know entirely, but we have an idea. And we do mm -hmm. know that they have a sensitivity to really loud uh, sonic boom sounds. It like messes them up so bad, mm -hmm. makes them vulnerable. Which makes um, sense, because yes. their hearing is so sensitive. So we gotta see how they're gonna use the cochlear implant from the mm -hmm. first movie, bringing that back. Loved that little bit. Good job remembering Well, dude, that. it was really cool, right? Like, that was the biggest thing at the mm -hmm. end of the movie, was they had a weapon to fight. So mm -hmm. it's not like they're completely, like, helpless. They have a weapon to fight with, and, and they're gonna try and expand this weapon, and, and they're like, look, no, we know how to fight them, we know how to kill them. And these guys are gonna be like, what? They're like, does it work? It's gonna be awesome. I'm looking forward to this. And yeah. the two Survivor dudes hanging out, both those actors are great. Mm -hmm. And they're, they're really amazing. they're really good supporting actors too. Very smart choices to have those two as your like random Survivor dudes, right? Because you believe it with those two, because Ch Chillian Murphy is from the 28 Days Later franchise. Mm -hmm. And then the other guy has done so many other movies mm -hmm. as like a badass that I'm not worried about. That. It makes sense when you see them as survivors. Like, yeah, okay. They yeah. would survive, I get right? It. Yeah. So teaming up with uh, with Emily Blunt, really, really cool. So we got to rate this out of five things. Emily Blunt is in this. We're rating it out of five blunts. Out of five blunts, what do you cool. give this, Emily Blunt's? Okay, listen. Hey. The first one was so good that the hype for this one is real. Yes. So I'm gonna dock it a little bit because I'm. Hesitant. Oh no! I'm gonna no. give it a four only because what? only hear what? me out. What out of five? Just hear me out. Blunts? Yes. You have five whole blunts. Sequels, horror movie sequels specifically, are either a hit or a miss. There's no in between. You're right. You know what? That's a fair so, assessment. That is a fair assessment to make. Most horror four. Sequels to horror movies are always hit or miss, mm -hmm. even if it's a, an established franchise mm -hmm. that is really, really good. Mm -hmm. This looks so cool, mm -hmm. and this looks like such a fun. I didn't think we would like when I when we finished a Quiet Place. I thought, oh, well, that was a, that was that was great. It's gonna be like Babadook, and there's only gonna be one. No, they've got a sequel, and now they could probably do it as a franchise. Yeah, probably. That would be smart if if Krasinski and Blunt were able to get well. They're married, right? So if, mm -hmm. if Krasinski Blunts. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. If they can have their own little horror franchise and keep that going that is really smart because they can write it they can produce and direct it they can they can have roles in it you know maybe Krasinski can play his twin <laughs> his brother's twin no I'm, I'm Joe or Dave my the twin long lost yeah, I'm back no. <laughs> to save the day right that would be I, whatever we'll figure it out a way to get Krasinski back uh, but Blunt and and crew look great. Mm -hmm. Chillin' Chili Murphy and uh, the other gentleman keep forgetting his name. He's tremendous. Uh, in the men's below, let us know we're done. Mm -hmm. uh, and then of course the kids were great too. What's yeah, her name was great. So yeah, good. I keep forgetting. Yeah, like hats off to them. They were so good and they're coming mm -hmm. back. Uh, but the idea of the surviving and, and getting a more—it's kind of getting a little Walking Dead. A little bit. It's getting a little Walking Dead. Mm -hmm. I like this because mm -hmm. because you know what? This is different. This is different. And I want to see where they go with it. So I'm giving it five whole blunts out of five blunts. Emmy Blunt. That's why we're saying blunt. So, uh, that's gonna do it. What's in the description below? In the description below, we have some links for some fundraisers for the Black Lives Matter movement, as well as links to our Instagram, our Twitter, and our gaming channel. That's right. Otherwise, have a life, have a day, or a night, live it 24-7. I'm not buying time. I'm buying time. Bye. Bye.